guys uh, today we will again start with this uh, third video of the whole uh, uh, playlist uh, the third video will consist of the program uh, we have to find the factorial of a number in this particular program so i'll write the prolog program to find the factorial of a particular number so let's say i have named uh, this as fact.pl yeah and uh, edit so I have to find the factorial of a number so what I need to do is I'll uh, create uh, the definition and it will has again two variables two arguments in it and uh, if n is greater than 0 obviously it will be but we have uh, put this condition just to make sure that n is greater than 0 n1 is n minus 1 this will help us to reduce the number if let's say I have passed 5 as my n then uh, in order to multiply 5 from 4 then again from 3 then again from 2 and then again from 1 I have to reduce it by 1 so this particular n uh, n1 is n minus 1 this will help me to achieve that one number that is less than the n number and again I will uh, recursively call my fact definition n1 comma f1 and uh, f is n star f1 I have to multiply you know so that's why I will uh, use this f is n star f1 in this case so i hope uh, now i'll uh, terminate each and everything and uh, yes i'll re i have remembered this uh, period here so we have made the whole program so now we'll have now we'll also have to add the terminating statement uh, terminating uh, predicate which will help us to terminate the program very effectively so i have added uh, this fact 0 comma 1 which will help me to terminate the program without this uh, we'll not get uh, our answer so i think it should work now one minute i like Compile it with the fact dot pl. It's working. Now I'll write fact. Okay. Fact. Let's say five comma r. Here r is the variable which will have the value of five factorial. So in this case, one twenty should come okay there is an error so we'll just have to find what is this error okay. oh what is this error i'm looking past the predicate here n is greater than 0 0 comma 1 Mm, n is greater than 0 n 1 is mm, mm, that's also fine n minus 1 n 1 I passed it again then f is f is n star f 1 Let's see where the error is coming. A one minute. Fact zero comma one. It should work. It's also not working. There is some serious error in this case. Hmm. Fact fact fact. Oh, let me see where the error is coming.
okay i have found the error i think i found the error uh i've used here this whole portion was if okay if this thing will happen then this portion will be will be executed now what about else so for else i should write um a statement which says write n should be greater than 0 so i Okay, it's not working again oh, let's see okay it's not working because of this particular error ah, now it's working so now we'll run the program oh five comma r i will have the value of five factorial in this case so it should be 120 and it's 120 and we'll uh, now we'll have two choices either we can um, press semicolon or we can directly press enter if we'll press semicolon then basically semicolon uh, uh, if we'll press semicolon then we'll have uh, other values as well as our answer but in this case we don't have any other value so we'll not get anything and if we press the enter then we'll get only this as value so in this case we'll press enter so yes this is the value if let's say I'll press semicolon then it will again see and it will uh, finally print this uh, this line and should be greater than zero because we don't have any other value here so let's say i have to print four factorial uh, this can be any name i is uh, so it should be 24 and i think four threes are 12, 12. yes it's right and uh, hmm. so this is the way how we'll print the factorial of a particular number and okay hmm. so uh, okay let's uh, again take another example fact uh, let's say fact 3 comma m you can you can take any other um, alphabet instead of this but remember you have to take the capital alphabet it should be six yeah that's correct so guys uh, that's all for this video and hope you liked it please do comment and uh, subscribe if you liked it and uh, if you have any problems regarding this video then please comment i'll uh, try to uh, solve your queries as quickly as possible thank you very much for watching this video